great pleasure to introduce Paul Pollock, your salutatorian, for some remarks.
My meteoric rise to stardom would be something to behold, and nothing could get in my way. Coach Musi quickly put an end to these trees. <laughs> to the five foot nothing, Cole Pollock, he said kindly, if you can grow about six inches and gain 30 pounds, then come back to me. As fall approached, my body had decided that it was not ready for varsity sports, in complete contradiction with my mind. Still only just over five feet tall and weighing a mere 100 pounds, I was not ready. I did, however, learn a lesson. It was the spring of my sophomore year when I realized just how hard I would need to work to compete at the highest level. My travel soccer team was composed of some of the best players in this area, and me, competing with talented teams from across the state. Again, I was exposed to what it meant to take my game to the next level. The following summer, I knew that if I was ever going to make a varsity sports team, I would need to work harder than ever. From 6 a.m. mornings to five miles of running a day to countless hours in the gym and on the field, I gave everything to soccer. All of this hard work and dedication came to fruition with a coveted place on the team. Was all this sacrifice, was all this worth the sacrifices I had to make? Personally, I, couldn't, I could not have asked for anything more from my high school career. Although I had to sacrifice a social life, some of my creativity and expression, participation in band, and time with my family, it was worth the struggle. Today, all of these sacrifices have been justified, and the effort to discover who and what I can be was not wasted. Whatever it is that you choose to do with your life, make sure you apply yourself to the fullest. What hard work in high school is taught me is that through perseverance, anyone can place themselves among the best in whatever they are willing to focus on. The self-confidence and motivation you receive from being your optimal self is priceless. Understand that whatever you are dedicated to, whatever you choose to throw everything you have at, that effort will not go unnoticed. Awards and recognition are not the end game. Helping someone else's day run smoothly is just as important for our society as the next scientific breakthrough. One of the reasons that this position I am so honored to have today means so much to me is because it gives me the opportunity to finally reveal what happens behind the scenes. For all of us, the time and effort we put into our endeavors is often only remembered by the final product. To the class of 2019, while you celebrate today, remember all of this hard work that has allowed you to arrive where you are now. As the future unfolds, find a balance in life and know that anything is achievable if you can organize what it is you wish to do, divide this goal into a path to reach for it, and ultimately go and conquer any obstacles that stand in your way. Thank you.